Hi, Greg. Hi, Morningwood. Hi, John. Not Johan, sorry. Hi, Chris. How Mickey Mario? Hey, it's me, not Pierce. Hi. I think I need another light. That light's pretty good. Ciao, Minky. Ciao, Python. Thank you, Morningwood. So, guys, do you want to chat a little bit or should we go straight to masturbation? What do you guys want to do? I'm sorry, I'm so sorry if I'm late replying your messages or late with your customs or late uh, with adding you on Snapchat. I am so sorry, but you have to understand I'm alone doing everything. And I don't want to be like one of those girls because, you know, I'm chatting with you and I want our relationships to be real. I'm sorry, but I don't want to be one of those girls that uh, pay someone and you know, like I would probably make more money, but I don't like that fake relationship with my fans. So I'd rather have you waiting instead to have a fake relationship with you. So it just takes time. But I mean, I'm totally ignoring uh, people who don't tip in messages because you have to understand that I have to give priority to people. So um, yeah, I give priority to, I don't reply at all to people that don't tips. For $3 now you get, I'm gonna be live every Sunday, uh, Saturday, a list until the world goes back to normal because I'm gonna be in my house so I can have a schedule now. And so yeah, I'm gonna be live every Saturday. Uh, we will see if this is the best time, like 9 p.m., or uh, we can figure out another time. See when uh, most people can. Because at the moment, I can't go anywhere. The restaurants are closed. Everything is closed. I mean, I don't really like to go out on Saturday anyway. So I'm most on Saturday, I'm working. So like I'm around Europe traveling, or if I'm in the U.S., but usually, I mean, late at night, I can always do stuff. Usually, I'm on set. By five, I'm done on set. Um, I much with when I go out. Um, I've been with my boyfriend um, almost 11 years. And we just uh, go around, try different restaurants. Or uh, we're like walking by the beach. We do really simple things. We see friends. Uh, we go see movies. We don't do anything like different. Thank you, Thomas. I hope you stay safe too. Mwah. It's been not fierce. Thank you, Adio. Stay safe too. Uh, penso di poterla caricare, Miki. Eh, buon lavoro. Immagino sia difficile di questi tempi fare l'infermiera. Thank you, Asi. Grazie, Radiars. Hi, uh, Yavora, I think is your name. Che lavoro fai, Jacuzzi? Se ce lo puoi dire. Thank you, you 94-72-72. What time is in Arizona right now? You like it? I, I've been... I was thinking to, to buy it. I need to buy a sewer machine because my problem, since I have a small waist, uh, most of the clothes are like losing on the waist. I, actually, I bought a few dresses that are losing. Like I, ha I need to do a few adjustments. Not many people, but I actually said the fashion design and uh, I decided how to make clothes, but I stopped doing it. Like uh, my boyfriend has his whole wardrobe designed by me. 
uh, actually most of it. But um, uh, for me, I totally, I totally stopped because you mean time. Did I get? Oh, thank you. Who who gave me five dollars? Piotrek, thank you. Ah, ciao Pietro, grazie, grazie mille. Um, yeah, guys, I can uh, posso parlare italiano e in inglese, dipende cosa mi chiedete. I actually, I forgot what I was saying. Oh, yeah, sorry, I can, I can, I can sell a little bit, that's what I was trying to say. What got you interested in politics and social justice? Um, well, since I was a kid, I've always been um, involved in politics because until you're born rich, there's a mosquito around, sorry. I think I got bitten on my foot, that's why I was scratching it. Um, so what happened, my, my, there was a big uh, earthquake here in South Italy, uh, not in South Italy, in like around Naples. <laughs> Damn it. Um, fuck. The good thing, I'm in the countryside because where I, where I used to live before in Pompeii city, the mosquitoes were, were like the tiger mosquitoes. So they will like sting, pinch you, pinch your sting. Uh, I'm not sure. Anyway, they will leave you those marks for like a week. Those are like tiniest, like our Italian local mosquitoes are, they're not too bad, but they still bother your ears and yeah, make your skin itch. Uh, oh, what got me interested in, in social justice? Um, so uh, there was a big earthquake. Uh, I, I think it touched Naples. I'm not sure how many regions it touched, how many areas. But anyway, my dad lost the mosquito noise on my head. My dad lost um, a lot of his prop of his properties. And when I was a kid, just because I was uh, like in the weekend, I didn't want to stay home. And my dad was like going to those like politics meeting. Since young age, I was like. Uh, I was hearing those type of conversation about social justice. Now, in Italy, when there's like um, something uh, that big that ruins life and properties, usually you should get money by, um, from the government. But um, my dad never got anything. What happened, the uh, city uh, basically used all the money. I don't know if they stole it, I don't remember what happened, but uh, most people never got any money. So my dad was doing those um, uh, those meetings with other people, they were in the same uh, condition and they were trying to understand what to do, how to rebel. To... So yeah, since young age, I, that's how like I, it started, but uh, you can't be, you can't leave and if you're rich, you can. If you're not rich, actually, even if you're rich, you should. Because even if you're rich, you can still get assassinated, you can get killed. Uh, I don't know, your dollars can get raped. You should still, it's in the interest of everybody to live in a uh, more equal world. So that's my opinion. Oh, sorry, guys, I wasn't reading. There's a way to go up. No. So, sorry, if I lost something that you want me to read or reply, uh, please post it again because for some reason I can't go up. No, I didn't kill the bug. I was trying, but I didn't. You want to see my feet? I should have touched the, um, the nail polish. I don't speak in English that often anymore. Because I, I'm in, in Italy, only like on Twitch I'm streaming in Italian since the time is stream is um, no, it's better for Italy. Thank you, Thomas. Thank you, Oscar. I mean, there's a lot of things I will not do, but I don't. But mentally, like I can talk about anything. I don't have. I said, like, oh, I don't want to talk about this thing. We can talk about anything. As it should be for anyone. <laughs> I only don't talk about things I don't know, but I will listen. Okay, I'll show you my feet again. Uh, that is, um, it's not that I have a fetish for armpits. For me, are just 
uh, a part of the body as anything else. Yeah, I'm a duet I, uh, since um, we all do. So this is my problem with custom. Right now I'm shooting also for, since companies cannot shoot, uh, I'm getting um, videos uh, committed. I'm not sure if that's a word. Anyway, companies are asking me to shoot videos. So right now I'm using editing to make sure you have an update because I edit uh, most of the videos. Some videos are concentrated with other uh, people, so they edit for me. But most of the videos you get on this feed uh, are edited by me. So if you see any mistake, I'm sorry. <laughs> that's, I'm still learning. Um, it's a lot of work to, you know, be a model, edit, uh, and do all the other things, do social media. So I'm working on that, and then also I'm getting uh, videos that I have to shoot for other companies. So yeah, um, but I can try. I want to try to do your customs. Unfortunately, I will have to raise the prices. I will make a list, and I'll see if that work. And if it doesn't work because it's too expensive for some of you, I'm sorry, but I feel like the option is rather to do or not to do it. But what I will do is, if there are certain videos that are, are certain fashion, even if it's a costume, so that person will get it because they pay for it, I will still uh, post it so other people can buy it. So yeah, if you are in an armpit, but you can um, you can afford to pay for a custom video, I will still uh, make it available for other people. Maybe I don't know. Maybe I'll say someone name in that video. I'm living in Italy. I live in the south. Before, um, yeah, I grew up in Pompeii City, and I moved more to the countryside. Uh, I'm, it's funny, Luis. I'm actually right now playing uh, free and boxing on Nintendo Switch, and I mean it's not really hard workout, but it still works. I'm, I'm having fun, so I'd rather do that than other stuff. Since I don't have any specific goal for my body, and even if I did. Uh, they're not, like it's not the workout can really make a change for me. Since if I want to keep boobs and butt, uh, I can work out hard as much as I can, but you know, the muscles are going to be under the fat. So as long as I stay healthy, I'm happy. I don't have really any specific goal. Uh, I will have to think about Oscar. So give me, give me time. I will make a, I'll try to make a list for this week. Con una trama con la... Uh, scusa, Simone. Pensi che dobbiamo aspettare molto per una bella scena con una trama quarantena tranquillini? Um, il fatto è questo, io sono, vivo col mio ragazzo, quindi ho soltanto lui. In realtà ho fatto una scena, um, ho fatto una webcam con un altro ragazzo, ci siamo masturbate, uh, con i Wolf. Non l'ho ancora montata, ma devo montarla e postarla. Uh, Dr. Pippi, what if I don't want my custom video shared? Then you will have to uh, ask for it and pay more. What is the weirdest thing you've done in sex? I don't know, because I don't find anything weird, really. So, I don't know. Depends what you think is weird. Are you making sessions for your fit worship? Uh, we mean sessions. Uh, as a, I don't think legal porno is too rough. Looking at their video, I mean, I, I, I'm not, I haven't like uh, keep it up with watching their videos. Uh, I only shot for legal porno in uh, United States. I never shot in Czech Republic. So I've tried in the past, and they wanted me to do like five anal, which is, I'm not gonna do that. And it's not just because. Uh, my asshole would be really dry after that. It's also, I don't like to um, to starve because when I do anal, it's like in private, I, I'll do maybe, you know, I'll clean up in the morning. I stayed all night without eating. So I clean up in the morning, I'm, I'll do it with my boyfriend, I'm gonna be fine. But when you're on set, you know when you start, you don't know when you finish. So you, in order to like make sure you're totally clean, you have to starve. And it makes me feel like it's actually healthy once in a while to do like a half day without eating, but five days in order, like, no, I'm not gonna do that. So, and also for, uh, yeah, for the asshole, it's not good. It's good to like give it a break. 
Um, I can get naked if Chris, if you want. Darius, uh, dicevo prima, purtroppo uh, ho tantissimi messaggi e sto cercando di rispondere a tutti, eh, mentre rispondo a quelli che mandano una tip. What sexual thing you have done that was the most fun? Uh, I love DP. I'll do... I mean, I love orgies too, but I, I enjoy the most DPs. And I did, uh, like, my last orgies was with, um, for Brad, Valentine's Day was a live show. I think it's still available, so you can go, you can go watch it. And that was amazing. It was so good. Because it was all DP, and plus there were other girls, and they were into anal too, so we just had so much fun. Um, non, non sono proprio una squirtatrice, e in realtà la maggior parte delle ragazze fingono. Ho squirtato due volte ed ero completamente bianco. Però non, um, non mi piace, uh, non mi piace la sensazione, non lo so, come, non era piacevole e quindi non, non ci ho riprovato. Tra l'altro c'è un pochissimo materiale scientifico sulla cosa, quindi non vedo perché dovrei fare qualcosa che non, non mi dà piacere. Oh, thank you, Thomas. Uh, I like to change. Like, wh when I'm in LA shooting, since I do more professional, I take pictures. Uh, I like to have nails. But here, I manage so many animals every day. Uh, I don't know if you follow me on social media, but I, I have actually I have a, an Instagram account for my animals. So I can't afford to have long nails. It will be, I feel like it will be dangerous. They will get dirty. I wash my hands so often that they, they will come off. So yeah, I like to keep them in clean. <laughs> Easy, simple. Do you like when guy come down on your throat? Um, my throat is actually really small. Uh, I was actually able to deep throat only two guys in my whole life and they had like really thin dick, which was perfect for blow jobs. I mean, for deep throat, but it wasn't really good for, uh, it's not really good for sex. I mean, at least I don't like thin dicks. There are some girls that prefer long and, th and thin, And I, I'm the girl that prefer a short and uh, thick dicks. Um, will you do more double in? Yeah, I'll try again. But I, I still, I don't think I can do it for uh, uh, somebody else's company because I need to pick up the dicks and I need to try and I don't want to be, I don't want to feel forced. And usually, you know, when you get booked, you have to already say if you're going to be able to do something or not. And I, I feel like all the girls that do double anal at one point, they start to prolapse. And I, I truly don't want that for your body, for my body. And I mean, I don't want it for your body too. Like I just don't, uh, I mean, the body is stretchable. So you can do fisting and certain things, but you have to know your limit. You have to understand at one point there's a limit. And if you're going to pass the limit, well, they're going to get, uh, things bad. I mean, prolapse is not necessarily a consequence of a bad anal experience, but when you go that far, it might help. Um, most people get prolapse just because they get old and they don't take care of their body, they don't eat enough fibers and they push them food. So yeah, guys, if I'm uh, skipping any questions or anything you're saying, I'm not reading it, please uh, feel free to post it again. I won't feel like spam. It's just, you know, I take time <laughs> to talk. Uh, I don't know why the name, Ke uh, Greg, the name you're writing is uh, is covered. I don't know why. Uh, does she have, is, what type of profile is it? Is it like an OnlyFans profile? Is it on Instagram? I can't really sing LT. Uh, I'm pretty bad at singing. <laughs> um, I think I had the morning. I had sex only with two Asian guys. But I think one was from Philippines. I'm not sure. Because it, it, was, Amer it was an Asian America. American, so you know they're a little bit mixed. Some of them, so I'm not. I'm not sure. I'm not that good at recognizing faces from Asia. If I, uh, I haven't, I watched the movie and I actually read the book Gomorra, but I haven't watched the show. And so yeah, the the, the topic. When you will share the price list for your cost, I'll.
get for next week. Uh, I'm sorry, I need that time to think about it because once you know you, you start to pay and you, you order stuff, I uh, wanna, uh, I don't wanna waste your time and I don't wanna waste mine. So, you look like your mother or father. Um, I think I look a little bit uh, more closer to my mom than my dad. Uh, I don't know. Consigli per fare un buon anale. Allora, la regola principale è essere rilassati e avere un buon lubrificante. Io consiglio lubrificante a base di silicone o olio di giojoba. Io uso il Pijur, che costa un botto, sono tipo 24 euro, però ne usi veramente poco. E la zona deve essere ben lubrificata. E sì, sì, senti che c'è il bisogno, o meglio, la persona che riceve l'anale sente il bisogno di uh, metterne di più, metti quanto ne vuoi, non ti preoccupare. Um, essere rilassati e seguire il proprio, uh, sì, seguire, se, seguire il proprio corpo, capire cosa il, vuole il proprio corpo. Ovviamente all'inizio si avrà la sensazione uh, di andare in bagno, però poi dopo un po' passa e arriva il piacere. Um, dipende dalle dimensioni del pene e anche da quanto elastica analmente la persona che riceve, però in genere è consigliabile usare... Uh, uno di quei kit di latatori, anche se la maggior parte li fanno in, in una plastica che fa attrito e assorbe il silicone, quindi l'ideale è usare quelli di uh, vetro oppure uh, quelli di metallo e andare gradualmente. Anche se non c'è un kit, magari comprare semplicemente un pad un po' più piccolino, uno un po' più grande, io per esempio mi sono fatta il mio kit per cui ho tre diodi diversi per prepararmi all'anale. She has an Italian passport with your picture. Oh, it's probably fake. They're doing that. That's crazy, Greg. Who are you talking about? Is this person? They're doing that with other people too. That is crazy. That is really crazy. The good thing, so for instance, if you want to open an OnlyFans account to make money, what do you have to do is to have, you have to hold the pictures with your face. Uh, So, you know, you can, you can make it, you can fake that. I mean, you, I guess you can with Photoshop. I've seen a picture of myself with different hair. That's crazy. Why are you worried to go to Naples? Uh, my mom is from around here, too. I actually had um, uh, sex with the uh, fan in the past, the morning mood is... I had a big gangbang for Rockets Euphrati with uh, 40 people. And also I had, um, I, I didn't post it here on OnlyFans because for OnlyFans rules, I only need to tag every person and they're 13. But if you go on Pornhub, there's a, a blog gang. I did it in 2012, it was a long time ago with fans. Right now I'm not really, I'm too old to have sex with an experienced people. I'm, I, can't, I get really frustrated, so I don't. I don't want to repeat that experience, but it was awesome for the time. So right now I'm wearing, um, it's kind of a sanction, but it actually you wear it like a wig. Uh, it's called the U-wig. So, but my hair is, they're like here. I do this mostly for, because uh, I don't like to style my hair. Uh, but um, like if you see, I'm gonna show you which type of, how my hair are right now. Uh, they're, they're like this, so they're not that, that short. I just, but as you see, those are my like natural hair. Sometimes I get more curly, sometimes like here they get more curly. Sometimes I have a really nice wave and other days I don't. <laughs> so if I want to like look more done, then I wear this and I can uh, put heat on them. They're fine. <clears throat> uh, is your natural hair? Um... How are you doing mentally in these times? Um, I'm actually really good. Because um, since I travel a lot for work, I have a lot of uh, hard time sleeping. And I'm still like not 100% of what I want to be with my sleeping, but I'm way more relaxed and, and chill. Uh, in general, I'm a relaxed person, but I'm talking about sleeping time. Like sometimes I just, I start to, it's not that I'm like stressed, it's just, I don't know, my brain never stops. So I always 
think about the stuff I have to do the day after. Um, and yeah, so I can't. This morning, uh, I left my dog in because uh, she's not fixed yet. And there was like a bunch of dogs. I don't know if she was like getting gangbanged or something, but I let her in just because I didn't want her. And I want, I want to go to sleep. So I don't want like to have, be um, uh, worried for her. So I locked her, her in and then I went to bed. And the first thing I did, I didn't even go pee. Like I woke up with the idea to of my dog to let her out. Um, yeah, and I keep her in a cage because I have a bunnies and other animals, and she's she's still new in the family, so I can't I can't trust her at the moment around my house. I watched the first scene you ever did with Mike Chapman. Lol, were you scared? Um, actually, as you when I did the scene, I had the fever. I the fever was I, I was like. It was a really high fever, but it was my first time on Rocco set, and I didn't want to disappoint him. And I mean, Rocco was kind of irresponsible too, to let me shoot. Uh, so I took like so much painkillers just to like feel fine. That I was doing it, but I was not feeling anything. And yeah, Mike, Mike was just uh, showing me around, and I was feeling more sensitive. Because you know, I like I, like my body was more something, but it was sexually I was not feeling much, so I didn't really like to think of that thing. Because for me, it was not a nice, nice experience. It was just like I don't know. I was you know I was wet, I was oily, but I had a. Italy is still a uh, little lock locked up. It's weird. Uh, like now they made those weird. Uh, they're not laws. They're like temporary laws. I'm not sure how to call them in English. Uh, I can Google it. Decreto. Like you can go uh, meet your girlfriend, but all if it's like a long, a long relationship. In sense. This is a decree, I'm not sure. Anyway, yeah, you can do a few things, but all the restaurants, movie theaters, uh, they're all closed. I'm good to eat, thank you. I love to travel. Um, if I wasn't living in Italy, I'll probably live in Spain. But I don't know, I feel like countries, they kind of have all the same problems. Um, it's so beautiful. I went to Uganda. My last uh, big travel was in Uganda. I mean, it was only five days, but it was like you know far, and we planned a long time before. And oh my god, it's beautiful. If that country was rich, it would be so awesome. It's such a beautiful country. The nature is amazing. The weather is is crazy. It's so beautiful. How much for a dick pic rating? For a dick pics rating, you can just send me a tip and I'll tell you what you think. Your favorite scene you ever did or top to a list? Um, I've done so many scenes. So lately, uh, probably the, um, the gangbang, no, this, sorry, the orgy with uh, Brazil. Uh, with Phoenix Marie, uh, with Luna Star, uh, Alexander Corvus. Oh, here this mosquito is back. Uh, did he die? No. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, yeah, I mean that that one, that orgy. And I don't know. I've done so many things in ten years of career that uh, sometimes I have to think about it. And that you know, you after a while you forget the pleasure. So. I will have to like watch them and then judge them as a consumer, not as a, an actress. And then I can tell you which one are my favorite. So, uh, Dr. Peep, actually, uh, when I started porn, my English was really bad. I didn't understand anything. I didn't speak any English. And then at school, I was I was really bad in English. I mean, I, I had like seven on 10. But I couldn't speak any English. I was feeling like an idiot. 
like I couldn't learn. But it's actually uh, the way they teach English in Italy. Yeah, because uh, like you do uh, the grammatic, and then you immediately start to, like read um, literature, but not like nowadays, like old literature. So you miss the whole point of uh, learning English because you're reading old English. And and actually not not speaking, but yeah, yeah, reading loud, uh, old English, which doesn't make any sense. That should be only left for extra courses, or um, uh, literature courses, or for university. Yeah, I said Uganda. I've been to Uganda. Been to South Africa too. I love, I love Africa. It's a beautiful continent. I've been to Morocco too. Well, I've never been to China. I want to go back to Japan. I've only been one time. Um, what else? There, there. Actually, that was there. Sixty six. That actually was my first sin with uh, Danny D. Oh, cool, the uh, Dr. Pip. Do you have a favorite porn star before to join this industry? Bella Donna, and she's still my favorite. Uh, Troy, I don't read the romance, so I don't have a favorite book because all the stuff I read is like a knowledge that I get, and then I even forget the title of the book because they're mostly. Um, <clears throat> wait, I forgot to say. Uh, Romanzi. No, Fagistica. Uh, non fiction. So, yeah, I don't read fiction books, really. And they're not really my thing. Cosa penso delle donne italiane in termini di sensualità e rapporto al sesso? Allora, l'Italia eh, ha un po' la mentalità da figa di legno, ma ce l'hanno un po' da, da, dappertutto. Uh, in alcuni paesi sono un pochettino più aperti, in altri di meno, dipende dalla persona, dalla nazionalità, non c'è un tipo. Certo, non abbiamo molte per non stare in Italia. Um, I come in, I, I, I couldn't read who, uh, I read the question, but not who asked me, sorry. But yeah, in most of my scenes, I'm able to come. Uh, sometimes I can't, but it's maybe because it's a position or because the scene, you, we cut down the scene of like five minutes and I can't come in five minutes. I mean, I can if I masturbate, but I can't come in five minutes if I'm, it depends. Like someone is fucking me really hard and I can come in five minutes. But most of the time I can't come in five minutes. So, yeah, yeah, that's, I, I hope I, I, I replied to your question. Grazie, you 2856, no, 2007. Uh, no, them for six, also because most of them don't speak a good English, so it's hard. And I'm already, I'm not, I don't make a lot of friends. I have very few friends. And especially in this time of my life, I'm kind of lazy in relationships. So, also, I don't like the mentality that most people have in my business. I feel like sometimes they have more like a escort mentality than a porn star mentality. There's really few people that are like in business. What's your favorite porn channel? Um, as a viewer, I don't know. I like if I have to masturbate and I want to watch something, I mostly watch in Thai, but I have to be honest, I don't pay for it. The thing is, since I edit my own scene, sometimes I get off just watching myself fucking, and I think at the time I shot the scene, uh, how hot it was, so I have to stop and masturbate, and sometimes that's enough. <laughs> Uh, well, Justin, my boyfriend is not in the business. He's a mathematician. And the guy, actually, he tried to join the business and then he decided to want to. And this guy is amazing. He fuck. Actually, I, I shot um, uh, a scene with him. Uh, and I did a webcam show a very long time ago. 
maybe I'll shoot like if after lockdown I'll probably ask him to shoot something for me because I can I can't really shoot besides the boyfriend right now until airports open open up again. Um, and then there's another guy in LA. I was fucking off camera, and he used to be a porn star, but I didn't know him before uh, when he used to be a porn star. And uh, I only actually I met him for something else because now he's a director. And I mean, I haven't had sex with him in a long time. I think more than a year. I don't have a lot of time for um, for private sex, and since sex is a part of my job. Um, also, let's be honest, it's hard to find someone that is going to be better than, you know, than a, a male porn star. So I don't see why spending a lot of time trying to find someone that can fuck me better and then get disappointed and frustrated. When I was younger, I had more time, I was more horny, I can't, but I'm almost 30, I'm like, I just want to go. Uh, no, I don't give my number to anyone. You, 82. Does sides matter? Um, the short question is, yes, it does, but it's not the most important thing. There are male talents that I adore that have under the average. No, I mean, they have a small dick compared to other porn stars. Like Robbie Echo or Michael Vegas, they have regular dicks. Uh, and I'm a side queen. Like I like big dicks. I love big dicks. I'm all about big, big dicks. But those guys are just so good at fucking that actually I'd rather have sex with them than with most of the guys with the big dick in the business. Besides, like really few guys. All that matters is the chemistry, how good their sex. You know, if you take care of your body, if you smell good, if you taste good. That's all that really matters. And, uh, you know your technique, um, how passionate you are. That's or those are the things that really matter. Yeah, my lips are natural. I never got them done. I know that's a question I, I got asked a lot, but yeah, it's yeah completely natural. I got my nose done a long time ago, but my lips are real. L'ho appena detto, io 33 ho rifatto il naso, l'unica cosa che ho rifatto. How many hours a week do you watch porn? Uh, right now I'll say none, because I was, I was saying I edit my own porn, so it's like, that's enough porn for me. Maybe if I stop editing. Actually, there was a, a, a time before I moved to my new house, uh, because I knew I was going to be so busy with the moving. It actually has been way more stressful than I thought, because the construction company has been a mess. So uh, I moved to my house and for two weeks. I didn't have a kitchen. The only furniture I is bad but I'm staying right now it's crazy it was so stressful I'm a real relax person I yell so much I got so mad every time and we didn't even have like a place where to put our clothes like they were in the boxes um why why it start to say that was the question in your opinion what makes a guy good in bed um a good thing is to be really trained in cardio. Like if you have a hard time fucking for a long time, uh, I feel like with most girls it's gonna be a problem because I feel like most girls need long, like a hard pounding for a long time. Like if you can do that, you're gonna be fine. And then just be passionate, like touch the body, feel, make feel the other person desired, uh, massage the body, grab the body, Chris kiss with a long tongue, use a lot of saliva, stuff like that. I can get naked. Thank you. I hope in a month you should porn. See, because I live in Italy, um, I, uh, what am I saying? Oh yeah, there's not really much porn to shoot over here. Actually, there's none for the shoot. So what I do usually, uh, I rather get called by company to fly to other countries, or I decide when I want to go to the United States, and then my agent, I have um, an American agent that manages all my scenes over there, which is Mark Spiegler. You can Google it. You can even look who is. is the best agent we have at the business. I wish everybody was working. We'll, we'll, like the business will be a better place. 
um i just said okay uh mark i want to stay there i'm gonna be there for a month and a half i'm gonna come usually i go at the beginning of the year and the past years i was going to the summer but i'll never do it again because it's way too hot and to have sex in 40 degrees celsius is horrible um yeah he was yeah, usually do that. So what happens if I stay there a month and a half? I'm gonna try to shoot as many scenes as I can for all the fans and also for um, um, for other people. And then sometimes I come back home and I don't shoot for months. I mean, not because there's been periods I have a shot for like two months. Not because you know I don't get offered, but just because I don't want to. Like I, I don't. He's other I don't want to. I don't want to travel. And yeah, quarantine has been great for me because I'm really, um, yeah, I can I can relax. I don't have to like, always live with a luggage in my hands. And I, I mean, I still love to travel. It's just the one you do for work. It's a, sometimes it's a lot. What like dick is good for you? Um, I really like. Let me think. Let me think of some little towns. I really like Jason Brown's dick. But I feel like it depends how you use it. Like other guys, oh yeah, I think that bigger than that, then it becomes too big. I love Shane Diesel, but I will not take that dick every day. Like it's like once, once in a while dick, maybe once a month, maybe less. You're such a good fan. Oh, I can't click it, I'll have to from my phone. Can't find you. Um, didn't find. Let me search for you. Okay, I'm pulling you back. Oh, I have to add the card. That's weird. Found. Okay, uh, to my favorites. Why does, okay, I just added you to my favorites. Thank you so much. Thank you, Seal Logan. Geotark, he has been tipping a lot. I'm gonna pull. No favorites. Thank you so much, guys. I'm gonna rest in Italia. Si, se me la fa la salvare, salvo la. Tre volte un'ora, cazzo, complimenti. <laughs> Meglio di Renzi, fortino. Ok, grazie. My favorite stiamo. Thank you, Jami Panda. Why does I have only one person with my favorites? Yes, you can DM me and DM me, DM me. So, why is this all of us one person? Sometimes all fans, I don't know, it's weird. Si, sono nuda. Okay, guys, I'll talk to you in DMs and I'll see you again live. Uh, next Saturday. So uh, I have a group question people that want to do a one on one. So uh, I don't see it working on, um, you know, on Skype. I feel like there's no way. Uh, I found this app. It's called Is My Girl. That uh, you can like uh, follow the profile for ten euros, and then uh, you can do a come a one on one on the app, which is really comfortable, and you pay by minute. Uh, but I, I, I don't really know if I want to use it yet. I don't know if I have the time. Um, but I feel like that will be the only way, like if you pay uh, minute to minute. At the same time, I don't see myself like going on Camp Soda or 
um, I don't know, mindfulness camps, those type of thing. I don't see myself doing that. Because unfortunately, I have to make choices. My time is not unlimited. So yeah, yeah, I'll save this video. So thank you so much, guys, for masturbating with me and talking to me. Mwah. Have a good night or a good day, wherever you are. Thank you, guys. I love you. And thank you for all your support. Mwah. How do I stop the live? Do you go to the